Hi everyone and welcome back to Tropical Marine Centre. Colette here. Today's video I'm going to be showing you our brand new optical auto top up. We're going to be unboxing this for you. I'm going to be going over the key features included in this product and we'll also be getting set up on one of these aquariums as well. So stay tuned if you want to see all of that. Thank you very much for watching. This is the brand new optical auto top up. It's got a high quality infrared optical sensor with triple detection points. It accurately monitors the aquarium or sump water level easily, replenishing evaporated water. Now it offers dry running protection of the DC refill pump with the anti-siphon valve designed to stop water flowing back into the reservoir. Now it's very easy to mount onto the tank with its magnet as well. Included in the box is the optical auto top up sensor, the DC pump, two meters of six by nine millimeter flexible top up hosing, the anti-siphon valve, the hose securing clamp, the PSU and instruction booklet. Now we have created this in mind for it to be ultra compact in size with the diameter of the optical sensor being around the size of a one pound coin or a one euro coin. Now we have also integrated an LED that provides a visual indicator of the water level. The maximum flow rate on this pump is 280 litres worth of water per hour. Here is a list of all of the dimensions and specifications which are available also on our website or you can pause this video on to take a further look. Now to get this set up on the next Wave 60 aquarium, I have chosen to use a bucket of RO water in the below cabinet on this tank so it's hidden away and I will be running my wires through the hole in the back of the cabinet and up into the back sump on the tank. Let's get this tubing bracket attached and the sensor in place. Now once I have got this where it should be within the water, I will then move it out of the water to test that it works perfectly. I've just placed a little diagram up on the screen to help you know exactly where it should be placed in the water. I just wanted to add as well I won't be using the anti-siphon valve for this tank because this is only for use when the RO container is at or above the water level. Now that was exactly what I wanted to see. You can see that the water is now pushing through from the bottom to the top because the sensor is out of the water. That's it from me today at Tropical Marine Centre. Thank you to everyone that's watched this video. And if you have enjoyed it, please don't forget that you can click the notification bell above to be reminded of all of our future videos. Or you can click subscribe if you haven't already. Now you can check stock of these items or anything in the video today by going over to our website, clicking on the item you want and then clicking find the dealer. It will then show you the dealer that is closest to you within your mile radius that you select. Thank you very much everyone and have a great day. See you in the next one.